Hello again. In this lecture, we will see how we can add new items and how we can remove items from an array. For an example, let's say in this movie's document whose name is Titanic, I want to add a new actor. To add a new actor into this particular array, I have to use a push operator. So let's say the new actor that I wanted to add is Rebecca William whose age is 45. So the command will go something like this. So I will say db.moviesnew. You will use the update menu command. Inside this update menu, as you already know, the first thing is the filter condition to filter out the document which I wanted to update. So in my case, the filter condition is name is Titanic. So the second parameter will tell me what I wanted to add or update in this particular document. So here I'm using the push operator. Okay, you will say dollar sign push and then start a new document and then tell in which field you wanted to push. So I wanted to push into the actors field. So this actors is, a, is of array type. I wanted to push into this array a new document. So let me write down here the new document that I wanted to push where the name is Rebecca Williams and then age is 45. So this is the content of my new document that I wanted to push into this particular array. So now close all of this. So now let's try to run this command on our Mongo shell. So here I have copy paste the command that we just discussed. Let me run this now. So I got the acknowledgement message saying one of the document has been modified. So let me see my Titanic movie. So here you can see this new actor Rebecca William has been added to this actors list. So similarly, if you wanted to remove some elements from your array, you can make use of the pull operator. Okay, so let's say I wanted to remove this newly added element from my actors list. I can change my query instead of this push. I will say, okay, pull out the element from the actors list whose name is Rebecca. So you can give any filter condition here. Let's, okay, so let me run this now. And again, I got the acknowledgement message. Now let me try to print this movie named as Titanic one more time. So this time you can see my newly added element has been removed using this pull operator.